Welcome to Drew's News Summertime Edition. Your tasty new sandwich with a good news pickle on the side. And with me at the desk is a man who likes parm with his pickles. And it's delicious. delicious. Rossi Ross Matthews. Yeah, yeah, I do love pickles, and that's a big deal. I have to say, I relish <laughs> moments like this. <laughs> Well, I was going to make a gherkin joke, but I'll just move on. Um, on today's special summertime edition, we're doubling down on food news. Yes. Nom, 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 nom. There she is, Sammy Sauls with her nom, 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 nom. All right, first up, it's the perfect TikTok trick for your barbecue. It's racked up over a million likes and counting, and Insider reports that it keeps your fruits and veggies chilling while you're grilling. Check it out. Step one, freeze an inch of water in the bottom of tray number one. Okay, and then what? Step two, assemble your fave fruits and veggies into tray number two. Okay. Delish. Step three, put tray two on top of tray one, and voila. So the tray of veggie goes on top of the tray of ice. Exactly. It's like a Ice tushy. <laughs> and Drew, food experts say that that's going to keep your, your stuff cold for hours. And it's like, you know, not plugged in. You could do it at a barbecue. It's like, you know, probably what the pilgrims used to do. I don't know. <laughs> Just use ice to keep it cold. By the way, um, fruits and veggies, I'm not so worried about. Try like fish. Yeah, right. I do have to say at a barbecue, I love a cold side, though, because it's a hot day. You're having hot meat. What's your cold side? <laughs> what? <laughs> I like hot meat. Um, my cold side, I love a classic slaw yep. and a classic potato salad. Yeah, I'm not so much in a potato salad. I just, you know. How come? Well, it turns out I'm allergic pota to potatoes uh, because they make me fat. <laughs> 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 my body swells when I eat them. So I love coleslaw. I do. I, I, do, I love all sides. I Baked beans. Oh, God, I can get it with a baked bean. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What about a macaroni salad? I yeah. love macaroni salad. I could, I could talk about macaroni salad all day long. I'm salivating. Well, we have another round of food news. Okay, this is a food hack, and it's one that's going to change your smoothie game. Eat This Not That says that the secret ingredient to make your smoothie super creamy is what? Hold on, drum roll. Cauliflower! What? In a smoothie? Now, you know, a lot of people use uh, people bananas sometimes to make it creamy. Bananas. Banana, nana, nana. But experts say fresh or frozen cauliflower not only sneaks in extra servings of veggies, it also lowers the sugar. And it's great for folks who um, have kidney issues that can't eat a lot of potassium, which is in bananas. Uh huh. And I've made cauliflower crust pizza. I put cauliflower in like chili to thicken it sometimes. I've done mm -hmm. it's just like half chili or half meat, half uh, cauliflower. Makes sense? It makes so much sense that I feel like you need to do that on the show. Uh, anytime. But now they're putting cauliflower in smoothies. We have one here. I don't know. I can see how it's going to work because the cauliflower is just going to kind of disappear. But I mean, by the way, feel how cold this is. Burr. Oh my gosh, it's super refreshing. Okay, okay. ready? I've Let's see. I haven't tasted this yet. We're gonna First do time. this. Ready? One, mm -hmm. two, three. Hmm. I. Uh, what? Do you even taste any cauliflower in there? Okay, Drew's busy. <laughs> It tastes like ice cream, like a milkshake. It tastes like a milkshake. That's exactly Like a malt. It. Yes. Whatever it is, I'd like the uh, recipe, please. Collie malts. <laughs> Collie Molly. Collie Molly. Um, by the way, I'm not kidding. This is, like, phenomenal. We have to put this recipe on the oh, website. I don't understand it, but I want it. I, I never want it to end. I don't know how it's good for me, though. Is it weird that we just trust and we just, <laughs> like, know. start drinking? <laughs> well, whatever it is, it'll be on our website. It is, like, seriously one of the best smoothies I've ever had in mm -hmm. my life. All right. Well, thank you for watching this summertime edition of Drew's News, and we can't wait to see you soon. And until then... May your fruits be cold and your smoothies be smooth. <laughs> That's sweet. That was in the prompter, but I do stand by it. Um, and take all the good energy with you. Bye. Bye. Bye.